Well, here's my uh, spec for star parafoil. I got it in the wind about 14 years ago. Um, cheap entry level, $20, maybe 10 bucks. Some of the Chinese ones now might be cheap, at least until Trump taxes the imports, if it ever happens. Um, yeah, this is at Lowry, and wind's been gusting 20 knots. And though I don't have Spectra line on there, I have Kevlar. Yeah, 150 pound test, uh, twisted Kevlar. Good old Emma Kites of China. Makes a good um, heavy line for very light line for flying. Especially if you go to kitty festivals and you're trying to fly a kite and you got all this cheap string around you and you keep tangling up to protect yourself somehow. I wonder if this thing still should up on film. Good old day at Lowry today. It's really all I had in bag that would fly. I guess some of my deltas would fly, but this would be kind of high end. They'd take a little beating. Looks like we might have another storm of snow coming in here pretty soon. Yeah, it's about an 80, 100 foot tail or so. I don't even know exactly. I think I just sort of put it together years ago and. I had spent, I spent like 45 minutes untangling that tail today because it has a bunch of snarls on the south side. I never did him or uh, it had the original heat seal on the uh, edges. So, I never got him. I just uh, keep flying like that and he keeps on getting little snares. Stop the tangling itself. Yeah, I'm gonna walk, take the walks and around the park. Yeah, I'm Lowry. I haven't seen so I guess Paul and Howard still come out here once a month. It's supposed to be first and third Sunday, it's supposed to be. 